A lot of people may see me as weird, but to me it's the most natural thing you can do. It's my calling in life, you know? My passion. Hi, I'm Huckleston the Third, first of his name, and I like to sniff bums. Oh, yeah. Yeah, so I first started messing around with bums a few years back now. I, I recall one day I was just sitting in the park and, and I caught the sweet scent of a passing bum hole. You know, it was like heaven to me and I've been hooked ever since. You know, it's not even a sexual thing for me either. Like, I get a boner only about 50 to 60% of the time. I usually spend my days down at the park, you know. I, li I like to hide close to a seat you know, and, and when I see a bum worth sniffing, that's when I make my move. Oh, yeah. I tell you, no bum's safe with these nostrils around. Oh, yeah, of course, it's, it's hard making friends, you know. I, I just want to get to know them as best I can, and, and what better way to do it than to have my nose pressed in between their cheeks, but unfortunately they don't see it that way and can become very hostile when I ask. So, uh, I know this sounds crazy, but can I sniff your bum? Dogs make friends by sniffing bums all the time, and, and nobody cares, so what's the difference? Like, you can you can actually learn so much from someone just by sniffing a bum. Like, just the other day, this, this chap walks past, uh, I took a little inhale, and I realised that he'd actually shit himself. You know, I would have never have known that if I didn't sniff his bum. It's actually terribly sad that society is, is stuck in the past and hasn't progressed to the point where this is acceptable, but I'm not going to let that stop me. Bum sniffing is my life, and, and who knows? With enough practice, maybe I can use my power for good and, I don't know, be the first human to be able to sniff bum cancer.